I told you, I'm fine with you faking it, but lip syncing? <laughs> wait, 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 blame that stupid Beyonce. She's the one who gave me the idea. Oh. I mean, if she can lip sync the national anthem, great. Why can't I lip sync an orgasm? Oh, great, great, great. Now, just because Beyonce lip sync on the national anthem, not every woman is gonna lip sync to their orgasm. Oh, but honey, it was still my orgasm you were hearing. I recorded it this morning before I went to Zumba. <laughs>
tell you some Alice's finest performances. <laughs> oh, let me be your telly, baby. Arnold, <laughs> oh, stop! 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 Okay? Look, our relationship is not a movie. You hurt me. You cheated on me and you lied to me. I don't want a sequel to our relationship, you know? As they say in Hollywood, this <laughs> franchise is over. <laughs> Sure. Yes, I'm sure. Now, would you please leave? Yeah, I'll, I'll go. Yeah. <gasps> Wait, baby! I have a great idea. What about a reboot? <laughs> it worked for Batman. It worked for James Bond. Whole new storylines. Whole new friends. You could even have another baby. I. <laughs> oh, Maria, don't worry. We have time. I'll be back. <laughs> Do you see that in there? <laughs> I used to move a line from one of my movies. <laughs> Maria, Maria, how about this? Come with me if you want to live. <laughs> Happily ever after. <laughs> you see that in there, Maria? <laughs> Maria? Maria? Hello? <laughs> Introducing Douche Wallets, a collection by John Mayer. <laughs> Hi, I'm John Mayer, and I've been with a lot of women. Well, let's see, there's um, uh, Jennifer Love, uh, there's uh, Jennifer Aniston, uh, Jessica Simpson, Prefect, of course. <laughs> um, I, I once got with this really uh, hot mother and daughter back from Tampa, but uh, they're not famous, so. They don't count. Uh, it's Cameron Diaz, Minka Kelly, Taylor Swift, and now uh, Katy Perry. Wait a minute. What was I talking about again? The wallet, John. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's right. Oh, wait one second. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Smells like Swift. Okay, <laughs> I'll do this. The douche wallet. Made from genuine faux Italian leather with two large billfolds big enough to hold up to five fast-acting, odorless, and tasteless tablets of Rohypnol. <laughs> One Photoshop picture of you with a super cute puppy or an elderly person you call Nana. Or one of those memory eraser thingamajigs from Men in Black. Oh, and as an added bonus, if you act now, you'll get a copy of John Mayer's own personal book of pickup lines, including these great ones. Or... Hey, you want to be one of my embarrassing anecdotes? <laughs> or the ever-popular... I heard you have a really big vagina. No, uh <laughs> Prove it. <laughs> Douche Wallets by John Mayer. Now at Walmart, and I'll find stores that men buy parts from guys like John Mayer. Guilty, ma'am. There was a big misunderstanding, ma'am. 
I tell you, I, it's not what you think. Wah, 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 wah,
We want no part of your fake movie plan, okay? We want to stay here in Iran. Yeah, we love it here. Hummus is amazing. <laughs> <laughs> what are you guys talking about? The six of you have been holed up here in the Canadian ambassador's house for several months. If you step outside, the Iranians will take you hostage. What's that smell? Oh. Please, very <laughs> Hispanic Ben Affleck. <laughs> Stop spreading the lies. You know, we, we are very well liked by the Iranian people. Yeah, we're like the Beatles here, man. <laughs> no, we're like the Bieber Beatles. Yeah. Yeah. And, and, and why would we take advice from a guy that almost married Jennifer Lopez? Oh, yeah. oh. <laughs> wait, wait a minute. Did you come here to make us watch Gili? Uh -huh. <laughs> it's pronounced Gili. <laughs> take you hostage, not only will you have to watch Shadow Man, but you'll also have to watch Ranger Man. Oh, no. oh, no. oh, no. oh, no. Man, oh, I can't even imagine what they might even do to the women. Something bad, I hope. Yeah, something naughty. <laughs> Excuse me? I tasted some of the local delights here, and let me tell you, having sex with Iranian men is like having sex for the first time. <laughs> Every time. But in a good way. Like, Taking a warm bubble bath. A warm bubble bath of sex. A bubble bath of sex and dark nipples. Oh, lovely and dark nipples. It's like making love to an olive-skinned Bradley Cooper with a short temper and dark nipples. Oh, dark nipples. Oh, dark nipples. Oh, so, so now, man, so now, all right. Bedford's getting upset, all right? The beer and
Yeah, we heard that you're the only one that has it. We've been all around town, man. Everybody has not left, and the hospitals don't even know when they're getting new shipments in. Yeah, man, please tell me you have some. I can already feel strep throat coming on, man. Whoa, 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 whoa. Don't bring that shit near me. Don't bring that shit near me. Or I'll lose your friend's bubble. Oh, shit. You're not like a bitch. <laughs>
to get things going. Mom, yeah, I remember buying this in Bolivia when I was studying abroad. These musicians gave it to me in exchange for I'm a panties. <laughs> Other cultures are so fascinating. Well, are you thinking what I'm thinking? Whoa. What do you say Friday night comes a little early this week? And by Friday night, I mean sex night. And by sex night, I mean the only night that we have sex this week. I want to make that clear. Yeah. <laughs> oh, you know, I just went shopping at Anthropology today, and I have an Indian headdress that'll knock your sex out. Whoa, 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 hang on there. What so fast, sweetie? Well, you know, as much as I would like to copulate with you, uh, I gotta get some sleep. You know, tomorrow night the boys and I are gonna go see Dane Cook. Oh, we could be out late, you know, like 10 p.m. late. Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> well, that's fine. Uh, yeah. I'll just uh, oh, rearrange my tote bags. There. Yes, my precious tote bags. <laughs> <laughs> They're like my children. <laughs> there, there, now, sweetie. You gotta remember. That being barren is a blessing, not a curse. Not a curse. You're right, you're right. <laughs> Besides, if you weren't barren, we wouldn't have been able to adopt Susan. Oh. Who the hell put all this damn mayonnaise in this sandwich? <laughs> <laughs> so fucking funny. Oh, no. <laughs> Oh, 
Meanwhile, Theodosia has just arrived in thriving 1960s Detroit to meet Mary Lou's husband, Sam, and his son, Richard. Where's all your animals? Listen, doll, why don't you uh, take that sweet little caboose to the nearest thrifty and uh, give me some cigars and booze, huh? Daddy's going to sit here and watch this Nixon candy debate on this newfangled color television. What's you saying? Uh, maybe it's politics. You wouldn't understand because you're a woman. <laughs> you look like Don Drysdale. <laughs> oh, hey, 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 hey! <laughs> only kid, only I can hit uh, kids in the 1960s. That's right. Yeah, and uh, King George taxes us fairly. Ah! <laughs> That's it. Time for a shiner. Oh, sure. After a quick commercial break, we were turned to by Mary Lou helping out her new daughter. Two plus two is four. She's away! <laughs> and Theodosia makes another reference from the 1700s that only she gets. What you mean there ain't no more staff tax? <laughs> That's it! Oh, stay tuned! <laughs> been in a bad relationship that you just keep moving one on to the next? <laughs> Have you ever not found that right special somebody? Have you ever just thought to yourself, oh my gosh, is there something wrong with me? <laughs> I know I have. And then I discovered the secret to everything that can make a woman happy. Extremely large genitals. <laughs> Turns out it was me. <laughs> I dated a lot of guys in my teens and early 20s. <laughs> they all seemed very nice, but there was always something missing. That was until I experienced extremely large genitals. <laughs> now, sometimes I smile for no reason at all. <laughs> Occasionally, I'm, I'm sore for a few days. <laughs> Why, <laughs> I was born with large, bulbous genitals. <laughs> and I've never, I've never had trouble meeting girls or, or making friends. <laughs> You know, uh, besides occasionally getting lightheaded during erections, life's been pretty great. All because of my super big genitals. Isn't that right, honey? I don't know. Is it time to do it yet? Yeah! Not now, but maybe later. So, fellas, don't fool yourself by saying it's not the size of the wave, it's the motion of the ocean. It's the size of the wave. <laughs> that's because the only thing that can make a woman truly happy is... Large genitals. Really yeah. large genitals! Yeah. Large genitals come in many shapes and sizes, including black, Hispanic, black, Hispanic, and some shades of white. Asian is not included. Large genitals. Get yours today. <laughs> Picked up my best friend slash roommate Betsy of 13 years out of work 
and uh, went camping down at Big Bass Lake to celebrate. Wow, that, that sounds like fun. Oh, fuck yeah, it does. You know, <laughs> you know what's uh, even better than two women in a tent? A three, three women in a tent! tent. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Now that you're joining men in combat, would you feel that there's any pressure to prove anything to your male counterparts, let's say, on the training ground or maybe even in the battlefield? Prove something? Huh? Do you know who you're talking to, Matt? You're talking to the Army's welterweight intergender boxing champion three years running. Let me tell you, I once killed a 300-pound wrestler mm. with his hand while I was sending a text with the other one. <laughs>
has rubbed off this particular bumper. But you know, <laughs> because she, she's still Lindsay Lohan. And if you can look past the dry, flaky skin, the smell of a pool hall at 3 a.m., and the gonorrhea type marking on her eyes, she's still Lindsay Lohan. <laughs> that was good enough when she was 15. Hey, okay, you're right, you're right. Yeah. All right, I'm in. I'm in. Okay, I'm not. I'm gonna do it with Lindsay Lohan. Yeah, there you are. I totally didn't see you there. 
you're on my to-do list. Sure. <laughs> John, I don't know. Oh, come on. You know it's bound to happen sooner or later. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I heard they are having the fresh fish that is salmon. <laughs> what a coincidence, because uh, I'm in the mood for some tuna. <laughs> Good night.